I like this one. I'm going to save it. Hey guys, welcome to my Mixamo avatar tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to uh, rig an a any avatar in Mixamo. Uh, it's going to be really good. Um, let's jump into it. Okay, the first thing you need to do is go to this website called Moral Resource. As you can see, there's many avatars to choose from. But um, the main thing you want to do is go to this button up here, which is the random button. This is my favorite button. You click it, and it gives you a random avatar. This is a sponge. Don't want that. I don't know what that is. Don't want that. Um, a cube. Boring. A world. Some man. A fish. A dragon. A pig. Some lady. A bird. A calculator. A rat. A kung fu man. A box. I don't know what that is. A surfboard. And the snail, I like this snail. I think this would work pretty well for us. I'm gonna download it. As you can see here, I put it on my desktop and leave it there. Now what you want to do is go to Mixamo and upload that that zip file. Why am I taking so long? There we go. And then your your model will load in, and just follow the instructions on Mixamo, or you can just watch me do it. You just want to put the dots here. Um, yeah, and it'll spin for a bit. That's my favorite part. This basically is the model uh, waking up. It's spinning and it's activating all the bones so you can play with it in the game. It might spin for a while depending on how good your model is really. Normally I get this first try. Um, you might not get a first try if it's your first time with Mixamo. It's taking a bit. Why is it taking so long? I don't, I don't know what to do now. I was planning on this. <laughs> oh, fuck! As I said before, just let it spin for a bit. You know, you just gotta be patient and let Mixamo do its thing. Oh. Merry Christmas. Okay, guys, I'm really feeling it this time. You know, first attempt. I mean, um, never mind. I think it's gonna work this time though. I'm feeling it. There we go. And the magic is done. As you can see, the perfect model. We're gonna, you know, just move ahead with this. You can see you can look around the model. Just perfect all around. There's your model. This is where you can do animations to it. Just to test it out a bit. Here we go. I'm gonna make it move side to side. Brilliant. Fantastic. Let's just choose a different one. Uh, it's like a good one. Make it throw its arms about. Yeah. That's pretty cool. You know? Just 
good old snail. Now we're going to download it. Make sure you put it as DAE. Whatever that means. Just, you know, download it. Oh. Um. Never mind. Then you want to make a folder and export, you know, the model to the folder from the zip file. Oh. Um. Never mind. There we go. There's your, there's your model. Now you want to go into Unity and just drag it in. Drag the whole folder in. Otherwise you'll be missing the textures. That's no good. You drag it into Unity. You can look at it. There it is. Perfect. But it could be better. You know? You just want to... I used this guy for scale. He's pretty good. And you can resize your model however size you want it to be. That's the magic of television. I think so. Um, yeah, you want to change the, uh, the material type to that. It just makes it look nicer. Then you want to go set it as a humanoid. So you can run around with it and it's going to be animated. Uh, make sure you enforce T-Pose. Just so you get a better look at what your model is going to be. Uh, next you want to delete the upper chest. And the toes. Then you want to make sure all the bones are in the correct place. Unlike this. This is not good work. Unity doesn't know what it's doing sometimes. And you've gotta you gotta help it. Um no. Uh, there we go. Much better. Next if you wanna use it in VR, you need to add some fingers to it. Which is basically just putting the other fingers on these fingers. If that makes sense. You know, it takes a while, but you just, gotta, you just gotta add some fingies. Otherwise, you can't grab things and your legs don't work. There we go. Oh, I know, you gotta change the whatever that is to that. If I remember correctly. Next, you need to, um, got to add a, a little ball this is your eye basically you need to move it where you can see from the model so just move it where it is best and then you want to do this you want to upload it because you're finished There we go. It's loading. You're almost done. Now you need to name it. Give it a description. So other people can know what it is. Then click upload. And wait a bit. It's all about waiting. You know? There we go. Now you gotta go check it out in the game. Let's go do it. As you can see, I'm in game now. This is the snail. It looks really good. I'm gonna test some emotes out here. There we go, backflip. Amazing. Die. Even better. Wave, you know, just a classic wave. Clap. 
What is that one? Point. Point. Everyone's favorite. Cheer. Dance. Um. Die. Oh, we would use that one. And sadness. Probably the worst one. You can jump. You can run around. You can sit down. Looks great. Oh. There we go. It's just. You gotta enjoy your model now. There we are on the tally. There's a stick. You can pick it up. There you go. Well, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Make sure to subscribe. And, um. I'll see you next time. Bye. What the fuck am I doing? What am I doing? This video was sponsored by High Rice Grill, the best Mongolian rice bowl in town. Please check out their website at www.highricegrill.au. Great food, terrible people.